All right, so lately I've been noticing a big trend where creators use anime clips with an AI voiceover to share motivational life lessons. And these videos are getting millions of views. And guess what? They're making serious money too. Imagine earning between $7.7,000 and $122,000 in just one month from these captivating shorts. But wait, there's a twist. These successful channels aren't just grabbing random anime clips. Using copyrighted material can get your account banned faster than you can say, Kamahamaha. Instead, they're crafting unique, original characters and bringing them to life with AI. And that's where AI Trend steps in. In this video, I'm going to reveal the secrets to creating your own stunning anime shorts using cutting-edge AI tools. And as a bonus, I'll even show you a simple trick to increase video scenes from the typical 4 seconds to make them longer. So let's get started. First thing we're going to do is create our script. For that, I'm going to paste this prompt inside ChatGPT. Generate an engaging video script on the topic of motivational quotes or life lessons. Keep it simple and easily understandable. Aim for a duration of around one minute. I will be using a man stuck at sea who finds an island and is eventually rescued to represent the visuals. As you can see, ChatGPT has created a motivational story with scenes and narration. Let's extract only the narration so we can use it for our voiceover and also ask ChatGPT to create prompts that we can use to generate our images. Now that our prompts are done, we can move on to creating our voiceover. For that, we will be using Eleven Labs. So let's copy our narration from ChatGPT and paste it inside Eleven Labs text to speech. We can choose a voice from the available list or search for one from the voice library. If you want to find out the best voice characters in Eleven Labs voice library, I will be leaving a link to a video in the description where I go through the 2000 plus English voice characters to select the best from each category. Now back to our voiceover. For this demonstration, we will be selecting Adam, which is a very popular voice on social media. Finally, let's hit generate speech to get our voiceover. Now that we have our voiceover, the next step is to create our videos. For that, there are various ways we can go about it. We can either choose to create a video using a popular video generator like Pika or create and animate images. I personally prefer the second option simply because it gives a lot more control over the look of the character and the scene. If you have a paid subscription to any of the premium image generation tools, feel free to use them for this part. But for this video, we will be using Leonardo AI for our images and more. So let's pick the Leonardo anime fine-tuned model and paste our generated prompts from ChatGPT. Feel free to tweak the prompts if necessary to get your desired results. These images look great, so let's try and animate this one. For the first try, I'm going to take down the motion to 4 and then generate the video. Keep in mind that you only get 150 tokens for the free account while these videos cost 25. So creating the animation here may not be ideal for free users. But that shouldn't be a problem as I will be using a free video creator as well. Now let's take a look at our video. This doesn't look bad, but our character isn't moving at all. Let's try again but this time I will increase the motion to the maximum. We have a lot of motion here, but our character is still not moving. I'm sure a few tries and modifications to the image prompt could help, but I prefer to use a different tool to animate our images. But before that, we need to finish creating the images for our other scenes. To save time, I won't be going through that. So let's move on to our video generation tool. The tool I'll be using is Hyper AI. It's completely free and produces some of the best results on the market. As you can see, we can use it to create videos from text prompts or simply animate our images. But for this demonstration, we will only be focusing on animating the images we created with Leonardo AI. So let's choose that and upload our image. Now we will increase the duration to 4 seconds and hit create to generate our video. Keep in mind that this can take a few minutes, and we may need to regenerate our video a few times to get the desired results. The result for this one looks great on our first try. As you can see, the video gives a sense of the boat moving, and our character is moving along while also moving his body. This is quite impressive, so we will repeat this process with our other images. If any of your generations look weird like this one, simply hit Regenerate to generate a new video. Now that our videos are ready, let's put everything together in CapCut. We'll import our videos and voiceover and drop them into the timeline, making sure our videos are arranged according to the flow of our story. As you can see, our voiceover is slightly longer than our video, so we need to adjust them appropriately. In this case, 
I want to increase the duration of our last video to make up for the few seconds of extra voiceover. This is where the trick I hinted at earlier comes in handy. Instead of simply duplicating our scene, we are going to reverse the clip and create an illusion of continuation. As you can see, our video looks like an 8 second scene without any breaks. Now let's add some transitions to our clips by selecting transitions and then dropping our preferred transition between our clips. We will also select the transition and hit apply to all to apply this transition to the rest of our clips. Next, we need to add captions to our video. So for that, we will select text, auto captions, and finally hit generate. Let's add some animations and effects to our captions to make them easy to read. Finally, we will choose one of these filters and extend it to the end of our timeline. Our short video is ready, but before we export it, let's add a background music. For that, we can simply go to Pixabay and download a royalty-free track. Alternatively, we can download one from YouTube's audio library, but that's only if we're posting our video on YouTube. Now that we have our background music, let's add it to our timeline and also decrease the volume. Our video is now ready to be exported. The final step is to increase the resolution of our video. This may not be necessary in the case of shorts, but you may want to do this for long-form content. So let's drop our video into vMake and wait for it to do its magic. Once it's done, we simply need to hit download and our video is ready. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the like button. Now let's take a look at our anime. Life can feel like an endless sea, where we drift aimlessly, hoping for a glimmer of hope. Hope is like that distant island, barely visible but always there, waiting for us to find it. When the going gets tough, remember the words of Winston Churchill. If you're going through hell, keep going. Finding solid ground in the midst of chaos reminds us that every challenge is temporary. As Confucius said, it does not matter how slowly you go as long as you do not stop. Every small step counts. Sometimes it's about making the most of what we have and sending out signals of hope and resilience. Remember, the best way to predict your future is to create it. Your efforts will eventually be rewarded. Keep believing, keep striving, and never lose hope. Your island of success is just over the horizon. Stay inspired. Stay strong.